Hey, uh, if you ever have an 88 key keyboard and you got your mic set up and you wish you could hit the bottom note to toggle your microphone on and off, there's a way of doing that so that you don't hear the note. And uh, because normally you would uh, hold it, you'd get a little thud of this lowest note and you don't want that, right? And so um, this little trick is going to make it so that you can toggle the sound on and off uh, just by hitting that key. Okay, so um, it's the A0 key we're after, but we're going to start out in Options and go to the main keyboard into MIDI filters. Now you don't need a suppressed notes here, I found out later, so you can get rid of that. All you need is this one right here, single variable controller. You have to, you, key range has to be two notes, it can't be the same note, so you can do node number 20, which is G sharp zero to number t note 21 which is a zero all right now this of course is below the keyboard so it's not even on the keyboard obviously the midi note numbers extend way beyond the 88 key keyboard and i picked target cc 121 and just had a min and max value value that's the default and that's all you needed there then Close that up, and I created a, uh, I guess you'd call it a mic rack. And in the mic rack, I have a my main keyboard in on channel one, controller, no edge button. That's the key that you have that as the uh, thing right there. And uh, my 121, mic input enabled and toggle. And now, when you push that button, it'll go off, e e like that. Okay, so isn't that great? Now you have control using that lower key, and the lower key does not sound, because as long as it's being remapped to a controller, it's disabled as a note. All right, that's the whole story right there. Take care.